Leslie. If you are new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. It means so much to me when you guys subscribe to my channel. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and let's go ahead and get into it. I'm gonna be making a quick little lunch because I'm hungry. I just finished a workout. I did a arm day today, arm and back, and a little bit of core, and I'm so tired already from holding the camera. And I want to take a shower, but I'm actually waiting for Amazon to deliver a new shampoo and conditioner and hair mask that I just bought. So I'm excited for that. So I want to like wait to wash my hair for that. I like a little crazy, but I'm tired of having my hair up, you know? My post-workout, I'm having this, this protein cookie. It is from Lynn and Larry's and it's so freaking good. It's white chocolate with macadamia nuts, you guys, and it's so bomb. I've tried a lot of their cookies. This one for sure, for sure is our top fave. Like we ordered the whole box and we're not tired of it. And me and Kai actually share one and my husband takes one to work. So we literally all love it. So I'm having that with some cafecito. So delicious. Kai is back there watching cars. So if you hear that, it's really loud. He's going to be going down for a nap very soon. But I want to start on my lunch. And I'm going to be having um, mushroom tacos. So lately I've been noticing, especially after COVID, taste has changed dramatically, you guys. I, I don't enjoy eating meat anymore like I used to. I don't enjoy like certain meats anymore. I don't like bacon anymore. Like certain stuff that I used to like, I just, the taste of it just is not the same after COVID to the point where like it makes me sad. I used to love celery and now it's just this awful taste still and like it won't go away. I've actually been making these mushroom tacos for a while now. I learned this recipe a few years back and every time I make them, my husband also loves them. You can do it with any mushroom. So we're gonna go ahead and marinate them just like you would any type of meat and the longer you let the mushrooms marinate the better so that's why i want to go ahead and do that now so let's go ahead and start marinating these mushrooms of olive oil to my mushrooms that just gonna help make sure everything sticks to it then I'm gonna add some lime add in some jugo magi and this chicken fajita seasoning from AGB it's okay I don't really like it that much it's just like really big and chunky don't like that a little bit of onion Normally I would add cumin, but I'm out, so do as you please. And I'm just gonna shake it on. All right, so I just cut up this big onion. I cut it up in half, and I'm gonna leave that in here for flavor. But then I'm gonna also throw these in there because I wanna grill them whenever I grill this or when I cook it. I'm gonna add in a little bit more seasoning. Delicious. Marinate, like I said, for an hour, and we will be back later. My sister, you guys. Hi. So. Ooh, I'm about to start getting ready for the day, and I thought I'd go ahead and film it a little bit since I'm gonna go ahead and start with my hair. I tried a new shampoo and conditioner. It's from Herbal Essences and I'm obsessed with how soft it made my hair and I feel like my hair is so much shinier. I'm gonna go pick up our groceries and I changed up my room, you guys. I went ahead and took down my huge mirror, my vanity and all that. I went ahead and took it away, took it apart because it just felt like it was just such a waste of space. I could use the space for something else that I've been wanting. So we're gonna go to Ikea. I've been wanting for a while and it has like shelves on the side. So I think it would be nice to like take some of the stuff that I have here on my vanity. I'm gonna just speed through this part so I can get ready. Guys, okay, so for my eyebrows, I'm gonna try a new product out from Benefit that they sent over to me. I wanna try it out because I haven't used pomades in a very, very long time. Just did the 24 hour brow setter gel. I love this thing so much. And then I also wanna try this new serum I got from Bliss that they sent over to me. It is a pore shrink and blur serum. So I'm gonna use like a primer. I'm gonna go ahead and try it. It's 
such a cute little pink, I mean pink, a little green bottle. It doesn't smell like anything. And I have big pores here in my nose. And it says like it's supposed to shrink pores more over time, like the more you keep using it. So we shall see. So basically I just use the concealer to shape my eyebrow is what they sent over this pomade it is called pow made raw pomade and i have the color 3.75 and 3.5 3.5 the 3.5 is more of a neutral brown meaning it's not going to pull red it's not going to pull too cool tone so this would be perfect if you kind of know that your brows are brown but you don't want it to be too red i personally do like a little red tint to my brows just because i feel like my hair does have like a little red hue to it so i'm going to use the 3.75 in warm medium brown so it looks really cute packaging and then it comes with this brush this is but the brush is really cute comes with a spoolie on this end and i love that it's clear that is so cute oh wow look you guys it even has i hope you can see that that it has a little thing that way you can put any extra product you know just kind of like use it here that's cute i like that perfect for like chocolate brown hair if you have if you color your hair like mine you will love the 3.75 from benefit and i like pomades you guys because i feel like it's easier to fill in all of your like bald spots if you have like a lot of bald spots becca professional forever i think it's called whatever matte this one's really 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 good Love this one so much this l'oreal foundation in the shade 445 it is such a pretty foundation it leaves you glowy oh my god and it gives you really beautiful coverage seal my under eyes charlotte tilbury setting powder it's just like a mini version and i'm gonna go ahead and set my concealer that we have put down earlier y'all already know how i feel about this i think it's the perfect perfect contour bronzing powder just because it's the perfect tone and with this one i've been using it a lot lately it's a play tint and basically it's just a liquid blush i like it because i can make it as pigmented as i want and it just melts into the skin and i feel like it lasts a long time too using this one from makeup revolution and this is the conceal and define 16 hour wear my lips i'm going to line them with kkw liner in two Stripped by ABH. It's been one of my favorites lately. It's like such a beautiful nude color. Super cute. I love it. I'm gonna go put lashes on and I'll be back. I am ready for the day. I'm gonna go ahead and make some lunch. My husband went and picked up the groceries. I didn't have to like go with him or anything. Me and Kai just stayed home. I was working on some posts for Latina Picosa. So if you don't follow me on my business page, I sell chamoy and chamoy gummies. Make sure that you do. I will link it somewhere right here. Show your girls some support and follow me. I want to make something that I've never made before. I see it on Pinterest all the time and it always looks so good and like something different. I have had curry chicken. Like not curry curry chicken, but curry seasoning. really like the taste of it. It's different. The smells also different and strong and i feel like this the smell does linger but i found out and i had red because i remember the first time i ever cooked with this i felt like my house smelled like curry and then you really need to wipe make sure you wipe everything down the flavor of it is really good i actually really like it so i'm gonna be making um for lunch right today some pita stuffed curry 
chicken, I guess like little pockets with these with this pita bread. I'm gonna cut them in half and stuff them with the chicken. So I'm gonna go ahead and start seasoning the chicken with this curry powder. I also bought this tzatziki sauce, which is a Greek yogurt dip with cucumber and dill. I already had it. So, and then also today we bought all of our groceries from Kroger because it's way closer. but like fresh like really fresh with the cucumber oh my god actually really good like a really good veggie dip i'm gonna grab a little bit of the tzatziki sauce and fill up Shh, because usually you don't like no sauces or anything like that but i'm just gonna add like a tiny amount and this will be my man's lunch looking good I want to add in some jalapeno slices in here. Tomato because I love tomato as well. Yum. This is my delicious little... Well, it's like hot Cheetos if I'm being real. But, anyways. Let me try one for you guys. Let's see. Wow. Wow. But this is good. Fast. But I do feel like I smell like curry now. You guys, I totally spaced out and forgot to bring the camera to Ikea with us. If you're crying, Kai's getting a haircut in the back. And that's why he's crying. Take y'all over here real quick. My husband is cutting his hair so I can tell y'all. I've been looking at clothing racks for a while. That way, whenever I do... Uh, haul videos and stuff like that Friday I got crazy and if you remember here I used to have lights and a huge mirror it was a huge Ikea mirror that was my vanity and I moved it over here I moved it to this window I left my mirror in the corner and everything over here is like how it's been like that's normal but on this wall now I have this wall so I'm gonna put the clothing rack right here While I was shopping for it it gave me the option to do curbside so it's nighttime already I'm tired I had a really really long day let's go ahead and do the laundry and get ready for bed because your girl is tired I made these pumpkin pancakes for Kai and my husband and they really liked them so I went ahead and bought more puree and I'm gonna be using this one and then you could just make your own pancakes or whatever but I do like this one from HEB the buttermilk one I feel like they taste really good and they come out so fast all you need is milk you can do water but we prefer milk so I'm gonna show you how to make these let's go ahead and make Sunday breakfast money coming money go I've been at it I've been at it on a low trapping out a while Keep seeing the leaders doing less, we talking plans and maybe seeing you Pull up on you, let me school. Nobody here but me and you Got a little ring to it, turn that thing fluid in the cool Why you look, I know it's real I'm on my my shine shit, I been really getting feel You know why I'm here, don't act like you know how I feel But let me tell you what you mean to me Slide on me for that mean greet Vibe with me in the moonshine, sipping moonshine to the new sky Taste toasted and be raised so, in the raincoat Hit the waist quota, I be flossing, I be locked in What's lost here? All that turned me to a target Plotting on me, I be cautious Back then I was an adolescent, then I had a lesson I'm the man now, I got fans now, I'm on cam now I got plans now, I'm finna branch out Real quick, but never let go this year All of that bullshit is in my rear. Hey, 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 h
Inks and papers, blowing vapors, sweating traders. Long hair killer in my villa, bitch, I made it. Used to play to play, now I think we made it now. She wanna lay me down, I'ma need you to. Alright, it's playing with Wally. And it's getting stuck. Balloon! The balloon! Someone got a haircut! So handsome! Oh! <laughs> gonna let the batter sit for a few minutes because I feel like it gets fluffier if you let it sit just for a little bit and I'm gonna get the pan ready so I can start making like bacon and everything else so let's go ahead and start doing that hold it down for me say it down for me say it say it hold it all the way down hold it down for me hold it down for me say it say it hold it all the way down say it down for me Put it down for me, say, say, hold it all the way down. Put it down for me, say, down for me. Wait, okay. I give a fuck what you telling me. I really grind like it's ten of me. Saw drip, I got the recipe. And you can find me where that pressure be. I'm really trying to see television. Fuck your elevation. I've been levitated in the preparation. I've been meditated. I've been hella patient. I'm so tired of waiting. I got right here with my day. Young niggas from where that crevice be. I've been solid since the lesson me. I here with the sea, really in the field. Niggas on cam now. I got plants now. Finna branch out. Grew up quick, but never let go of this here. All of that bullshit is in my rear. Hey, blues and papers, blowing vapors, sweating traders. Long hair killer in my villa, bitch, I made it. Hey, 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 Used to play to play, now I think we made it now. She wanna lay me down, I'ma need you to. And it is done, you guys. I just sliced up bananas on top. I like to add pecans. We love pecans, so. Hi. See ya, guys. And the reason for this is. See ya, guys. But I took down the huge mirror that I had in here and I put it in our bedroom and I just moved my vanity desk that way and basically now I won't have a mirror for now. Eventually I do plan on getting one. I really want a mirror kind of like the style like impressions vanity mirrors that come already with the lights. So that's going to be something that I hope to spoil myself later on in the future. But for now, I really don't need one because I have this huge window so so much natural light comes in here. And then I just have this small mirror. I think I got from Ikea. It is a clothing rack with shelves on it. So I just think it would be perfect for what I'm trying to do for my room. Anyways, that's going to be my goal today. I really want to set this up. So I'm going to try it. And I never do anything by myself, like setting up anything. But somebody is going to come later on to buy my son's crib. So my husband has to take that apart. So he's gonna be doing that and I'm gonna get started on this. So it looks like it's going to be the perfect size. Like look, this is the the amount and definitely this is going to fit on there. I just hope it's not too heavy for it. easy enough struggle with patience and like little details like this if it's not something that I enjoy doing it's gonna be my first time ever doing anything like this by myself so had a breakdown because i had kai here with me as you guys saw in the previous clips and he managed to put all these little tools that like come with the ikea stuff in these little holes so literally it's i don't know if you can see it it's in there my husband he has like a lot of tools so he actually had these and saved the day thank god but i'm almost done with it and i'm so excited i look really glowy right now and oily let me finish this all right you guys it is done and i love the way it came out it's a little bigger than i anticipated i'm not gonna lie i thought it was gonna be maybe just a little smaller but i'm not mad at it 
perfect for exactly what I needed it for. A place for my perfumes, my brushes, purses, and a few shoes. And then of course all the clothes I will be styling. Just gotta fix all that. Basically I just gotta like fill those holes up and paint but i'm not worried about that right now cleared up so much space on my vanity which is what i wanted because like i said i wanted to use this as a desk not just to do my makeup but also as like a working desk like when i'm editing and when i'm working on my business and stuff like that i need a desk like when i'm printing out orders and i'm printing out stuff that i need to ship so um yeah i'm really really happy this isn't a huge huge room like our rooms are a little smaller but i love the way it looks now let me show y'all show y'all the room what it looks like now so this is what it looks like now i love it perfect little area so i can work and edit but also do my makeup when i need to do it and then everything that was all this stuff used to be all over that desk i took it off brought some stuff in love the way it turned out and then for now because i have these huge things where the mirror used to be i'm just hanging some um hats for right now here but i think it looks super pretty i want to be daring baby dance the night away i let my head down if i Perfect, so i can work don't you just get tired chasing fame